Hey everybody, thanks for clicking in. Today we're in a state Southgate, five minutes east of Christiansted, adjacent to the Green Key Marina and the Tamarind Reef Beach Resort. This is an awesome location and it's a gorgeous villa, all custom built and designed by the current owner. You're gonna love this place. It's got five bedrooms, six and a half baths, pool, gated entrance. I mean, it really has it all. Whether you wanna use it as a family retreat or a vacation rental, either way, this place is perfectly suited for either option. I think you're really gonna like this place. Let's go check it out. Okay, here we are at the gated entrance coming into the parking area. You've got a well in this little well house there. Tons of parking, beautiful stonework, gorgeous trees and fauna here. It's just beautiful, beautiful setting. And look at that gorgeous villa. You've got your upper level, your lower level, pool off to the right. And then in here, we've got additional parking, lily pond, just so serene and tropical and beautiful. It's amazing. And then here's an entrance into one of the uh, apartments, which we'll get to in a second. Here we've got the generator and some storage. And then above, there's a nice little gym. Beautiful setup. Check out these Danis arches. They've got the keystone, beautiful brickwork. As you enter this gorgeous villa, you just come down this hallway of arches, just a mind blower. Off to the right, you've got access to the big front lawn. And then you continue straight down and we're at pool level, gorgeous fountain, nice little lounge off on the side. And then check this out. This is where you're going to spend most of your time in this gorgeous outdoor dining area with soaring ceilings, lots of air coming through those openings, leads straight into the kitchen. But check this out. I mean, you just have so much space to chill. Just gorgeous. And remember, your boat is just across the street if you got a boat. Can't beat that. Love the little dolphins in the pool. You've got a shallow end here. Lots of steps here for easy entrance. And then here we are into the deep end with another set of steps coming straight in. Just a great setup. Got a full bath off to the right, a guest suite there. And then here we are looking back towards the entrance in the driveway. Just a fantastic outdoor area. Hard to beat, I'll tell you. All right, let's go inside and check out the house itself. Right off the driveway, through the arches, and into the main house through this beautiful entry foyer. Notice the custom mahogany woodwork throughout this property. It's amazing. You've got all Pella windows with the integrated Venetian blinds that slide up and down with a simple tab. And then here we are the indoor formal dining area, and then check out this custom mahogany staircase that leads up to the master suite and a separate living area as well. Just gorgeous. Access to the pool off to the right, access out to the outdoor dining area here, and then here again, your indoor formal dining area. You know, if it's a hot day, you can put the AC on and Stay nice and cool while you have din din. Check out this wood paneling, all custom made, all the balusters and everything, just amazing. Nice little powder room off to the right and then straight into the den. More of that gorgeous custom mahogany all throughout, including the desks. What a great office this would be. Or a TV room, you could convert it into like a family room or a library. Either way, it's awesome. And then out this door, you go out to the outdoor garden area. Fantastic. Now we've looped around back out to the formal dining, quick left into the kitchen pantry. Check out the size of this pantry. You've got closets on the right, closets on the left. It's like a whole separate kitchen here. You've got a double fridge, lots of preparation space, You've got your integrated micro. And then off to the left is the kitchen. All right, let's go check that out. Out of the pantry into the kitchen through another beautiful arch. Check this out, just a gorgeous kitchen. This is a four to six person kitchen right here. You got your wet bar, bottle cooler, triple sink, dual ovens, vented hood. I mean, this thing is ready to roll for a big dinner party, maybe a catered event. I don't know, a lot of options. And I love this pass through, check this out. Hey, anybody need another cocktail? If they do, this is where you send them. 
Great setup, and then right into the formal living room. So the layout of this house, you can really tell, was super well thought out. Now you got a laundry room right here. There's a guest suite we'll get to in a second here. But check this out. Full-size laundry, utility sink, folding table, lots of cabinetry, and then the door straight out to the gardens. This is a beautiful part of the property. You got your hibiscus, mahogany trees, and the owner of this house did a wonderful job. They're not blooming right now, but when these bloom, these are some of the most beautiful orchids you'll ever see. There's the master bedroom up top, and then back into the second door, which leads us straight back into the kitchen. Beautiful layout. All right, that's the kitchen. Now we'll check out the suites. I actually just noticed the orchids are starting to bloom now. When one blooms, they all bloom. Okay, right off the kitchen, into the poolside guest suite, gorgeous bathroom, nice big shower at the end, tiled all the way up, and then straight into the bedroom itself. Love being poolside. If you want to take a swim, here you go. Kaplash. Oh yeah. Not a big room, but a very comfortable room. Got AC, and of course, it's located poolside, so that's hard to beat. All right, while I'm over here, let me show you. There's actually a full-size pool bath on this side. You've got your vanity, you've got your toilet, you've got a shower, extra storage. So if you're having a pool party, this is a great convenient amenity to have right off of the pool area. Okay, that's this side of the lower level. Now we're gonna go on the other side of the front door and check out the two bedroom apartment. Okay, I've reset back out at the driveway, looking through the archers to the front door on the left, and then through these arches is a separate two-bedroom apartment. Perfect mother-in-law suite, caretaker's cottage, separate VRBO. A lot of options with two bedrooms, its own little kitchenette, fully equipped, and two full baths. This is awesome. There's one full bath. We've got your dining area. Here's bedroom number one. Lots of closets placed to the right. And then down the hall, we bank a quick left into bathroom number two. And remember, this is two bedrooms, two baths. So this is a really nice apartment. Closets on the left and the right, and then into the bigger bedroom right here. That's a queen size bed, AC above, and then windows out to the garden. Just great. And then here's the lockout door. So if you want to connect to the main house, you just keep this door open. And then here you are back at the front foyer entrance. Awesome. All right, let's go left, head up the steps. And we'll check out the master suite. Up this grand mahogany staircase to a landing where there's an awesome custom mahogany inlay. Just gorgeous. Boy, whoever they hire to do the carpentry work is something else, man. This is just beautiful. There's your upper level lounge right off the master suite. And then right at the top of the steps, you come into the master suite through these hand carved doors, big palatial room, king size bed, high ceilings, lots of light and windows. And remember central air in this part of the house too, which is a real plus. You've got your walk-in closet to the left and then here we go into the ensuite bath. His area to the left, hers is to the right. This is a nicely equipped setup. There's your water closet, beautiful travertine shower, bifold glass doors, very nicely appointed. And then on this side, you come over to the jacuzzi tub, another vanity, and then this side has the bidet. Great layout, great setup as a master suite. All right, we're gonna pop back out, past the staircase, and then here we are into the private upper level lounge Great place to chill and have movie night. Lots of space. And then here we are looking down across the steps into the formal dining area. Just gorgeous. Okay, now let's head out. We're gonna check out the upper level guest suite. Right off of the upper level lounge, down the walkway. And here we are at the upper level suite, poolside. Now this is kind of cool, this is a big room. You've got sort of a living room here, 
space to the right, space to the left, and then bedroom dead ahead. So you could really make this sort of a kid's bunk room if you wanted. You could put in some bunk beds, inflatable mattresses, make this sort of the Xbox PlayStation area. You got the ensuite bath, beautifully appointed, gorgeous tile work, rain shower head, bubbler tub. I mean, this thing has it all. Perfect for kiddos to come up here and make some noise. They wouldn't get in your way, sort of out of everybody's hair. Or perfect couple suite, can't beat it. And then here back out to a separate covered patio right off of the suite. So you could set up a lounge out here, take in the view. You've actually got a peekaboo of Green Key Island right there. Really nice. And then here we are looking back down on the pool. More beautiful archwork. And now there's a separate set of steps that leads down to the kitchen from the suite, which is kind of convenient. You know, if you're having close guests around, they want to have easy access to the downstairs. They don't have to come through the main upper level lounge area to get there. And then down off on this end, another private little patio, great place to chill, take in the view, take in the breezes, look down on the gardens, beautiful front yard. And then of course, back over to the pool. But just look at the architecture here, it's just gorgeous. Hard to find this kind of quality, especially at this price point, love it. All right, let's head back down and check out the gym. Back out of the driveway again, front entrance, two bedroom apartment entrance, generator room here to the left with additional storage. And then through the gate down to this beautiful outdoor patio off of the library. This is actually a dog wash station. Believe it or not, there's hot and cold water there. So if you've got puppies, here's where you can bathe them. Alternatively, you can make it a planter or another fish pond, that's up to you. I'd keep it as a little puppy spa. All right, we sneak up the back alley here through the beautiful neem trees, past the little patio, and straight into this beautiful little gym. Perfectly situated, nice and private. Oh, and there's somebody even using it. How are them calories going, Steph? Burning them calories. Nice. Great little spot to work out, chill out, and then down this way, you have direct access back to the driveway. Great little gym, totally separate from the house and perfectly situated for that daily workout. All right, let's head down to the front yard and check that out. Okay, I've made it back down to the front door on the lower level, opposite the pool, across this beautiful brick patio, down the stone steps to this amazing, huge front yard. Check out the size of this thing, it's awesome. Beautiful, huge, 100-year-old or more mahogany tree with like a four-foot diameter trunk. Look at that thing. It's a beautiful tree. And then a gorgeous row of date palms that lines the front of the yard. But just a great place for bocce ball, cornhole, whatever you're into. Throw a frisbee, you've got the space to do it here. Anyway, if you guys want to check this out, give us a call. We'd love to show it to you. It's a beautiful villa here in Estate Southgate. They don't come along often, but when they do, you need to jump on them. If you want to check it out, give us a call. We'd love to show it to you. In the meantime, have an awesome St. Croix day, everybody. Bye-bye. I really hope you guys enjoyed that property tour. If you did, please subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking here. Click up here for more videos just like it. We'd love to see you move to beautiful St. Croix. Maybe one of these days, we can make one of these awesome properties all yours.